What's up, man? It's your big brother, K. Reno. I want to shout out to my homie, Kofi, from Kofi's Universe. Y'all make sure to subscribe to his channel and support everything he got going on because he be dropping that knowledge. Yeah! YouTube salute. Or I wanted to cover this story, y'all. The Black Panther director, Ryan Coogler, speaks out after being mistakenly suspected of attempted robbery. Let's talk about it. If you're new to my channel, thumbs up the video, hit the subscribe button, click the bell icon to be notified when I upload excuse me new content check out benny the butchers tana talk Four review and the album review playlist so ryan kluger was detained by police after being mistaken for a bank um robber this actually happened in january i didn't even know that so ryan kluger was in atlanta attempted to make a withdrawal from his account with bank of america the teller received an alert on his account, according to the police report obtained by CNN, because the amount was more than ten thousand dollars, he was trying to actually withdraw twelve thousand. The teller notified her superior that she thought Cougar was trying to rob the bank, and nine one one was called. Cougar had had a written note on the back of his withdrawal slip stating that he wanted the money to be counted discreetly. Given the amount, according to the report, when the police arrived, two of Kugler's colleagues who were waiting for him in the park, excuse me, in a park vehicle outside the bank were detained also, damn, and placed in the back of a police car. Kugler was placed in handcuffs while police investigated the call. He was released shortly after they verified his identity, the police report states. The situation should have never happened. However, Bank of America worked with me and addressed it to my satisfaction, and we have moved on. This is what Cougar said in a statement to Variety. And so right now, he said, we deeply regret that this incident occurred. It should have never happened. We have apologized to Mr. Cougar. This is a, the Bank of America um, representative. And Cougar was in Georgia at the time the incident and he's like i said finishing um up the black panther 2 and it's coming out actually what is i think it's the end of this year or beginning of 2023 black panther wakanda forever what do i think first and foremost it's always something going on i mean you know i looked at the situation you know they said the woman panicked the woman you know she saw that amount like oh my god what's going on I believe it wasn't even a white woman. It was a black woman. That's the crazy thing about it. So, you know, before people go off getting crazy, like, oh, white people. But it's still the situation of being involved with law enforcement. I'm glad this situation was actually, you know, it, didn't, it, it wasn't blown out of proportion. What I mean as far as like it could have actually got to another level. God forbid if they would have pulled their guns out and shot Ryan Cougar. Oh my man. That would have been crazy. Like for real? Y'all were, you know what I'm saying? Like if we seen incidents of mistaken identity, somebody thought something, or my bad, you know, I was misinformed, or I didn't know, and I was scared for my life. But in this situation, I'm just thankful that the police checked, you know, for identification, you know, did their job and said, OK, let them go. Because if they would have had an asshole that maybe would have woke, woke up on the wrong side of the bed, he could have just went in there and said, F it, it's, it's going down today. And that's the last thing we need. You know, it just and it's not just Ryan Kluger. Don't get me wrong. I respect the brother of everything he's done. It's any black person. I don't want to see no black person getting shot, especially if they're just trying to withdraw money from their account. But if you do the crime, you the time. I can't get mad at you. But, you know, if you're in there trying to rob a bank, I mean, what more can, you know, what can, more can I say? Well, if the police come and if you ain't trying to, you know, you know, obey the law and they say, put your hands up. Well, what, they, what more can they do? But if you in there to say, hey, I'm trying to take out some money on my account, yada, yada, yada. It is what it is. OK, cool. I know. And I'm going to tell you right now because I, I, I am uh, a Bank of America customer. And there are ATMs in the bank now that you got to go inside the bank. And there's like, um, whatchamacallit, there's like a, a virtual um, person 
that when you go to the bank and put your money in, they'll say how much money you need. And you can take up to like $20,000. They have this out here in L.A. And I remember one time I had took out 8000 And the person, um, um, one of the Bank of America um, employees was like, hey, how you doing, sir? What, what are you here for? I said, I'm here to take out some money. Like, oh, how much? I said, I'm here to take out 8000 He's like, oh, you can go over there to the ATM. I'm like, for real? I'm like, yeah. Like, I thought it was only 1000 Like, no, 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 you can take out 8000 He said, you can take up to 20000 I said, I didn't know that. So when I went over there, the the um the Bank of um America um, representative was like, how you doing? Like, oh, wow, this is virtue. It's like looking at somebody on Zoom. Put my information in, you know, with my ATM card. They was like, how you doing? I'm good. They said, um, okay, cool. Can you just show you my ID? Show my ID. Bam. Money came out right then and there. Like, wow. So... I don't know why he didn't use that, but maybe they don't have that technology or that type of, um, you know, ATMs out there in Atlanta. But still, thank God nothing happened to him as far as being shot, killed, or any of his colleagues or just anybody in that bank. But y'all let me know what you think about this story. Post your comments below. Hoax smash Black Panther the like button. Subscribe to my channel. Click the bell icon to be notified when I upload new content and go live. If you want to support and donate to the channel, I have Patreon, patreon.com slash Universe. Venmo, Cash App, PayPal, Streamlabs, everything's in the description. Until next time, salute.